Hey, how's it going? Welcome back to Mitsutsumi! The next day I was so preoccupied with that she was... What, who's she? With what was going on to happen at the school that I could barely pay attention to anything! Nothing can find you're not fine! It's you are crazy! That's the school is about to end for the day. Madam Warner's over me for the up tint time. It's setting really. I'm trying not to let it show on my face, but I guess it's impossible. Anyway, I suspect that nothing important happened in class today, so whatever. What are your plans today, madam? That's amazing. So, Her eyes are sparkling. Honestly, I'm glad she's not going to be. She's not going to be home today. But somehow this seems awfully convenient. Like two days in a row? Really? Look at Kyoko, who's packing up her things. She's smiling a little sheepishly to herself. What the hell? I only know one person who can orchestrate people's behavior on this kind of scale. Nani? Oh, uh, nothing. I'll pass. Thanks. So? Moshkoshte, Taichogawari? You already asked me that yesterday, you water wart. Kinoa, Kinoyo. Kyoa, Kaunga Kaisi, Kyodof Shindashi. She just towards me? I don't stop her? Her cool hand feels nice against my forehead. Yapari, Skoshi Atsigane. I'm fine, really. Though maybe I have a slight cold. No, you go and eat your donuts. Oops, that came out as a katadama. Mm. She seems to notice and shakes her head slightly. Sorry, do whatever you like. I put in a little more feeling into the second katadama than the first. Arigato. I was careless. That was a first. I mean, she did mention that he used an air for, I think. But I scream. That was definitely a first. She and Kyoko wave as Chad uh, uh, leave the classroom. Oops, I uh, ungrammared. I look out the window. The sky is clear today, just like yesterday. Even in the air-conditioned classroom, I'm sweating a little. I feel almost as hot as my clothes as it looks outside. Hmm. After that, I returned home and took a shower, look how that last. I paid extra special attention to clinic my groin area. As I came out of the bathroom and crossed the cafe floor to go upstairs, Kokura notices me. Hi. There aren't any customers right now, and the Sukasan is out somewhere too. Hi, Kokura. Uh, who told you? Hotarundayo! Onaji class da mo! Ah. A home date? So that's how Hotarun explained it to her then. Well, yes, that's right. That's why I took a shower. I was worried I might be kind of sweaty. Ahaha! Ima sara sanna no kini shita te, ni san no hea ja imi nai no ni! Huh? Really? Uh. <laughs> Okay. She flushes me a strange smile. Oh jeez, I didn't meant to fall to all over the house. 
I, I see you. Shit, I just got hurt! From my own smell! Since what I'm going... Since, since what I'm about to do with Otero has been on my mind all day, even stuff like this from Kokura is tearing me off. Kokura still loves me, and even still wants my body. To be buried, I work discreetly. That's true. Oh, yes, very much. Thankfully, she hasn't taken that conversation in a weird direction, so I managed to calm myself down. No, that's okay. I'll make some myself and take them upstairs. Hoi hoi. Thank you for not insisting. I'm making horrible crap. The front door opens. I heard Jet as I turned around, but it's just a customer. Irashimase. The guy looks a hot too, but no. Too tall. I'll head upstairs now. Oh. Tukura is busy serving the customer now, so I don't need to talk to her any further. Yes. Okasa mo inai si, watashi no kangaeta shin recipe o tabete morau chance. Uh, Kokoro? Nani? No cooking until mom gets back. Thank you, Makoda. After returning to my room, I sit to bed and keep glancing at the clock impatiently as I wait. I was in the shower about 20 minutes and changing clothes and making drinks. T drinks? Took about 10. So, in the worst case, I might have to wait an hour, half an hour for Hot Road to arrive. Should I clean up uh, my room a bit? I stand up. But I always keep my room clean anyway, so there's nothing to clean. I sit down again. What am I, a virgin? Who do have thought that they'd be getting so excited after all these years? I've locked my room door slightly ajar. Why? So I can hear what's going on downstairs. Several customers seem to have entered the cafe, and I hear the front door opening and closing, as well as Kokoro's energetic voice. I'll look at the clock again. It's been one minute since the last time I looked. <sighs> Wait, when I lived at the village, I used to be really good at killing time. I close my eyes. I think about those long nights at the village when I had nothing to do. Thinking of nothing, I simply breathe. First, I inhale. Then, I exhale. Just by repeating these two steps, I begin to calm down. I'm not calming down at all. My heartbeat shows no signs of slowing. I open my eyes again. I can't help but laugh at myself. Jeez. So lucky what guy am I? Suddenly, her Kokoro call out especially cheerily downstairs, though I can't hear exactly what she said. I also hear Hotaru's voice. I start to get up to go and meet her, but I immediately hear footsteps coming up the stairs. They're very light, a girl's footsteps. Hi. Hello. As I greet her, my mind still feels foggy. She must have taken a bath too. A nice smell comes wafting from her direction. Her hair also looks a little damp. I did as instructed, uh, sir. She smiles, she must have been making the same observations about me. Yes? It's fine. If anything, I'm very happy I get to spend time with you. She does smile at my words, but her eyes are looking around restlessly. I stand in front of her. Oh, I know this is going to be sudden, but there's something I want to check with you. You sound kind of different today. 
my day. Am I right that you've come to my room today because you want me to make love to you? Hey! <laughs> Hello! <laughs> that makes a weird sound. Sorry, you didn't see that right. The way I put it just now, it's like I'm letting her do all the work. I get seriously at her again. Adriel, oh, I want to make love to you. But if I'm misunderstanding your intentions, if that's something you don't want me to do... Her voice is terribly soft! I see. So I was right after all? No, should, uh, should, should we chat a bit first, maybe? I look at her, puzzled. I mean, I assumed you maybe uh, maybe you had something you wanted to talk about. She nods, more quiet than usual. Well, I see that, but recently I've started to, to wonder whether this is the real Hotaru. And the noise the one I've come to know uh, was just a temporary phenomenon. Maybe deep down she's easily embarrassed, easily surprised, and timid. She puts her hand to her heart and takes a breath, then looks up at me again. Yeah. I know. I nod gently as I listen to her speak. I already figured out, out from how everyone reacted when they heard she was going out with me. Thank you! Thank you! <laughs> she seems relatively calm and she replies to my thank you with you're welcome. I guess it goes to show how well she was raised. It's strange, huh? I see. I can't help but smile. But she seems too focused right now to crack a smile of her own. あわてたりしながら考えたんです。このままじゃちゃんとした恋人になるのに時間かかっちゃいそうだし。考えて。考えて。好きだから考えて。いや、心が動かないなら体からでもいいんじゃないかなって。変な意味じゃなくて、体が繋がれば心の感覚もちゃんと繋がるんじゃないかって。だから、ミーさん。There we go. Jesus, I just sit in here in a pallbearer position. Let me see some silly hair feet as she puts her clothes back on. Are you okay? I felt pleasantly drained too, but I recovered fast enough to already be done putting my clothes on. I was worried she might be feeling sick, but apparently she's just still entranced. 
She asks herself a slight smile on her face. Then she slowly drops her hands to her belly. <laughs> After maybe eight months. She didn't use the word, uh, Seaman, but it's still a little tired. So I get her amusing report, I turn to look out the window. It's still quite bright outside. What should we do? Should, what should we do now? Do you want to go downstairs and get some cold drinks? You're not gonna mention your other hotel? Already? え、変な意味でなく私が広々すぎて心ならまだしも今の姿をまなちゃんや小豆さんに見られるといろいろ気づかれそうであと家でも夕飯前にお風呂に入り直したいんです。What's wrong with people realizing what we did? There's a faint sensuality to your smile. Ah, you were right. I'm impressed and happy. Before we made love, you wondered whether connecting to me physically would help you connect to me emotionally too. Well, I think it did help. You feel different somehow. Looking at you now, yes you do. So that's Ah, she brings her face close to mine. I'll, I'll, I'll lean forward. Our lips meet. She makes a small sound as we kiss. And after our lips part, our faces remain in close range. Mary, cute. <laughs> I already do. I grasp her arm, but she looks at my hand and gently shakes her head. What? I'm stunned. But Otero, not noticing, slips from my grasp and hops a few steps backward. Yay! With that, she leaves the room. All I can do is watch her recede. Her first time? I think she said that once or twice just now, but... That's impossible. I mean, I made love to her that day in the classroom. Beat. Beat her in the orange glow of sunset. In which case, was she joking just now about it being her first time? But no. What her blood when I entered her today, too. And the way she reacted felt like it was her very first time, too. Huh? I'm a little confused. Okay, uh, very rem not remembering that's one thing, but waiting for the second time. Is it possible her high, high man and grow back and uh, since then? I don't know that much uh, uh, about anatomy, neither do I. But I've never heard such, uh, uh, never heard of such a thing. I just don't understand. But, well, there is one possibility I can think of. Could it be that the hot I met that day and the hot I met today were different people? Twins, maybe? No, that's stupid. I love at how over uh, overactive my imagination is. No, oh, she must have just been joking, and I. Clueless as I am, take her seriously. I decide to abandon this insolvable dilemma and lie back on my bed. God damn it. 
I felt pleasantly tired. I just, I, I wanted to just drift up to sleep like this. I closed my eyes. My bed smells nice today. Oh, there goes out my cock. It smells like hair. As my gut just feeds, I hope the smell will stay with me for a while. Chapter changed once more, and it's now number seven. What is going on with her?